Craftsman mower dies when trying to engage blade or let out clutch. Welcome to Just Answer Small Engines, let me try to help you. I don't know at all, but maybe together we can get you a satisfactory answer. Model number form under the seat. Example 917 to 12345. This is a safety switch problem, seat, brake or PTO switch or the harness to them. If this is zero turn, check the two arm switches. Curtis, I ran over a small stump, but the stump did not reach the deck dot or blades. I ran over it with the front but not up to the deck. I got a big bounce on the seat as well. Dot then this began. Check the seat switch and the harness to it. Okay, it looks okay to me. A little loose, but it could have always been that way. To wire switch, put a jumper across the harness to eliminate switch for test. Okay, I will try this and report back. Okay. Curtis, should I unplug to jump? Yes, unplug and jump the two wires in the harness. Curtis, I jump the wires. Dot same problem. Okay. Curtis, I have located it. A metal flap pushes a plastic pin when pedal is pressed. It all looks okay to me. Dot how could the running over of the stump have caused this, you think? I'm thinking it loosened wire harness or bent something. Okay, what should I test now? Look for harness damage under the engine area, wires to electric clutch. Curtis, when I pull the knob to engage the blade the engine dies as well, I guess this is normal with this problem. Yes, safety circuit is not complete. Put seat switch back, if you have not already. Page 33 in the owner's manual linked below has the wiring schematic in it. Check it for continuity between switches. HTTP colon slash www.searspartsdirect.com slash partsdirect slash user manual slash 9172750023 Craftsman Parts Lawn Plus Tractor Manual. Manual index equals zero. How many switches are there Curtis? Looks to be only the three, but I do see an operator's presence relay, a square relay about inch square, it may be problem. Locate it and tap on it. Or replace it, Napa Auto Supply should have replacement. I see is there any way to bypass anything temporary to mow? This looks to be over my skill level possibly. Try locating the relay, under dash, it will be the only one there. Tapping on it may get it work, bypassing is not going to work. Curtis I've noticed the shift lever does not to want to move at all when clutch is depressed. I don't remember this before. The speed lever on the right fender? It may not move with clutch down. I assume it is in neutral. It has no neutral switch, so it shouldn't affect start. Have you located the relay? Curtis, can you see it here? Back of dash, bottom one is red, and red strip is the amp meter. What at the one above with black slash blue wire? I do not see a relay. There is a harness down to the right, but it looks to have nothing in it. That's the hours of use counter. Number 81 in the diagram is the relay, looks like it might be behind the engine. HTTP colon slash www.searspartsdirect.com slash model number slash 9172750023 slash 0247 slash 150920.html. Search type equals model search and Q equals 917 to 275023 and search term equals 917 to 275023. I see Curtis. Could you tell me more about the seat switch? 
Amino took my meter and there is continuity across it when I press it. Does this mean it's working properly? Yes, if it makes and breaks, it would be considered good. Are you ready to see the problem? Notice red wire. Okay, bad connection at the battery. All that checking smile but glad I found it. What does that wire control, small red? Power wire to the fuse, and on to key switch. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.